You know, people always ask me, why? Why do I do the things I do? Why have I decided to build a business, to build a gym? Why do I dress the way I dress? Why do I have all these tats? Why do I ask so many questions? If you know me, you probably know that I ask a lot of questions or my conversations can be quite deep. And I think those reasons are because, because of hurt, uh, because of suffering. And I think subconsciously I've done a lot of it and a lot of it to the core is quite deep. You know, a lot of people also ask me why <laughs> even question the universe? Why question anything at all? Uh, why question the purpose of life? Mike, why can't you just be? Just, just get along in life. I think curiosity can be the saviour to us all. I've had my fair share of questions and I've had my fair share of digging. You see, at the age of 12, you know, where I was still working out the steps and curiosity of life as you do as a 12 year old. You come into this world not knowing what the hell is going on, working out who you are as an individual in this broad spectrum of the universe. Who are you? What's your purpose? Why are you even here? So without even getting a real good chance to work out what was going on and to build the relationship relationships that I had at just 12. I lost the closest person to me at 12. Uh, she was my best friend, she was my rock, she was my mum. And before I knew it, subconsciously I was hurting without knowing. I. I did stupid shit, you know, at the time I found a girlfriend was, which was a saviour to me. You know, I lost one loved one, gained another. Before I knew it, I, I forgot the beauty of life. I found myself digging a hole so deep, trying to cover up all the hurt, trying to put a massive band-aid over my scars. I found myself digging down this rabbit hole of drugs which led to abuse and at a very young age I came so close to committing suicide because of all that shit I swept under the carpet and I don't expect you to understand because without going through this traumatic suffering and such devastating emotions that you can't even put words to I don't expect anyone to understand Therefore, I don't expect anyone to be able to answer my whys or even understand why I ask why. All I want to do is get as far away from the suffering that I had to go through as a human being. You can't not stop and ask why a human being that has been gifted this amazing thing of life. Why on earth would they want to end it all? Why? And that led to my discovery of self-development and <laughs> just asking so many questions. I want, to, uh, I want to run as far away from all that suffering and all the hurt and uh, all the emotion I had to go through. <laughs> and I, I'm not saying that <laughs> I've gone through it all. I can easily understand that some people are going through so much worse. But all I want people to know is that if you're going through any suffering and you need help, do not stop to not ask why. That could be your saviour. It could be your life. I'm here saying this is my journey and I wish to get as far away from suffering and hurt and band-aids as far away from it all as possible and I'm looking to drag anyone with me to get them as far away from that shit as possible. I think this is in the end all of our purpose. Who doesn't want to live a healthy and happy lifestyle? 
again if you haven't gone through any of this hurt and suffering I don't expect you to understand and I don't expect you to understand my reasons to want to help so many others I believe that the people have gone through the most suffering and hurt also have the most potential to make the best out of themselves and to help others as well a saying goes don't try to conquer the anxiety of death face it and meet it with courage that is what I intend for myself and what I intend to help others see beyond all my questions and all my curiosity all I want to do for myself and for others as us as a collective has moved forward in life but a happy one at that I can understand when people are tired when they haven't gone through as much emotion they don't stop to question they just go along in life as if they're asleep as if nothing is going on as if they're on autopilot through all my suffering I've finally woken up finally and I intend to help others wake up as well. Please, question why?